Hello, sweet souls. Happy Monday, April 4th. This will be your full length reading on YouTube under Tasha the Divine Guidance. Um, if you're interested in scheduling a private reading, follow the bio and TikTok at the description on YouTube. Any issues or concerns, you can send me an email. Uh, also, I want to let you guys know the Inspiration Company is running a promotional uh, period from now until April 30th, and it's for Mother's Day. Um, they're natural stone bracelets with inspirational quotes. And you can get 25% off if you use my code TASHAS25. Like I said, it's good till April 30th. So if you're interested in that, just head over there and check it out. We're going to call on St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender. Anyone sending ill will through that order action toward myself or the viewer. Um, I asked for, I asked the Holy Spirit Angels and Saints for a message for April 4th through the 10th. So I already pulled cards. I will do clarifiers. So the first thing that came out was temperance. This is inner balance. Um, this is divine timing. This is things lining up the way they're supposed to. Um, you're really stepping into your strength and your power, and you have this creative new endeavor that's coming in. You're going to have to make the choice. Um, they're saying don't be in your head, you know, feeling like you can't do it. This opportunity is meant for you, so take the chance. You manifested this new opportunity that's coming in. Okay, so then they went on to this relationship. Um this release of a family foundation that was not built on stable ground that you had to release. They're saying, don't worry, because from this, you will receive the divine love that you deserve. Um, and someone, which this is not your energy, is feeling very rejected or abandoned, filled with a lot of anxiety, regrets. Um, but you are divinely protected because you can see from a different perspective the lesson in the situation from the past. So you have a complete understanding about why you experienced it. You're coming out as the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Wands. Whether you're a man or a woman, very loving, very kind, very empathetic, but very driven right now. You're going after your dreams. You're going after what makes you happy. And you have really learned to love yourself, um, which is causing someone to be very burdened. You protect yourself from this person. And of course, it's the devil that came out. This is the past energy that is heavily burdened because they can see um, just how amazing you are. You're coming out, out of hermit mode, out of isolation. You've done all the healing work. Uh, for some of you, you're still going through it, but for a lot of you, you've already gone through it. Um, you're planting the seeds for your future and you are planning um, and open to receive this complete emotional fulfillment that's headed your way. You're patiently waiting right now because you know it's coming. The wheel is turning in your favor. This is good luck, fame, fortune, destiny, and it's meant for you. And like I said, this is causing someone to be up in their head because now they see you are the empress, whether you're a man or a woman. You are in your power, proud, confident, and you emanate prosperity. You emanate abundance. Um, everything about you is in alignment with God. And it's amazing. You are headed on this new journey, a brand new leap of faith that leads not only to financial security and stability, we have the king of pentacles here, but a true divine counterpart, a soul connection. Victory is yours, okay? Victory is yours. Um, you have new opportunities coming in career and finance as well. This may be hidden from you at this time, um, but just know that it is coming in and it's coming in pretty quick. You're entering a time of peace due to this healing that you went through and so much happiness. It's gonna happen out of the blue. This divine connection uh, will come in. For some of you, you may have already met this person. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Doesn't have to be it's someone that's very stable and financially secure, but it's going to happen when you least expect it. So that's pretty exciting. They want you to know all of these opportunities coming your way is your justice for all that you've endured. All this horrible lesson that you had to learn, it's your justice. So let me get some clarifiers and see if there's anything else they want us to know. Always comes out. See what that is. You know, this person from the past that was dishonest, very deceptive. The divine has pulled their protection from this person. They have left this person to their own devices because this person um, refused to listen, refused to change. And this person is heavily in regret and depression. You, on the other hand, are moving forward. You're planning for the future. And your ships are coming in. Passionate new beginnings are headed your way. Um, 
and it's exciting. You're happy and you're excited about your future and your life. Um, no more pain. There's, there's no more deception or betrayal in your future. You've already learned that lesson and it's over. It's over. It's over. You're going through a brand new beginning, one where you will be working with other people, helping other people, and it's gonna to lead to so much financial abundance, which is a gift from God. Wheel of Fortune again. So the wheel is turning in your favor and things are lining up for you, like I said, which is bringing in these offers, new opportunities. Um, this is work and career, new opportunities that are gonna generate so much income, stability. And you have no desire to accept any offer or apology from the devil. You just don't. It came out just like that. You're just, you're over it. You're over it. And you've already done the healing work. And you're just moving on. Moving on. This comes out all the time. You know, you're divinely protected from this player energy from the past. God protects you. God makes sure this person cannot interfere in your life. Um... You know, they went to a karmic that is a manipulator, emotionally manipulative, um, manipulating this person. And this person took no, no action toward you. And now they think they can come in and because they realize, yeah, they realize they threw away their everything, their Ten of Pentacles, because they were a player and now they're miserable. This comes out all the time, guys. I don't know why, but it does. Yeah. <laughs> They're saying this person is just as emotionally manipulative as the person they went to. So they're a good pair. They're a good pair. It's a karmic lesson. Yeah, this person is not receiving equal just like they did to you. It's part of their karma and it's happening now. Divine timing is now. Yeah, they're defeated. They are defeated. Yeah, this person made you feel like you weren't good enough. They were bored with you and um, you were their true divine counterpart and now they're heartbroken because of the choices they made. God said, well, keep them blocked. You learned that lesson and you leveled up. Yeah, let them keep the third party. You don't, they deserve each other, guys. You have real love coming, real love. Truth and clarity, sort of victory, exposure as well. Yeah, you know, you have so many opportunities coming in and you're not accepting less than you deserve. You're cutting people out and you don't care about people's drama or conflict. You know, you learned what you needed to learn and whether this person is sitting in this rejection or abandonment is not your concern because you're manifesting new beginnings and you're waiting because you know that they're coming in for you. Yeah, this person's trapped because judgment's been called. You're focused on you and they have to watch, hold on to you. Watching, wishing, hoping, they have to watch your complete emotional fulfillment with a true divine counterpart and be heavily burdened because you're the empress and the star. You're also the lady of luxury, starting a brand new cycle in your power, proud and confident, financially stable and secure. Then it's your justice. They can't rush in. They can't. There's too many lies and secrets, too much damage was done, and this person is now stuck. Okay, guys, that's what I got. I love you. Have an amazing day. Bye-bye.